Okay, guys, this is on. Oh, the crosshair is centered. Holy shit, now it feels so high. Wow, in different games. In different games, it was kind of like normal, you know, but. Right now, in hand, I was so. So adjusted to having that crosshair like. Uh, a little bit, well. Definitely way lower and right now it's a bit strange. I don't know the map completely guys. We just dove in Oh, that's crosshair is gonna be a bitch I can tell you already Yeah, we got some problems with the frames also. Oh, there is someone here. He was passing there, we'll have a Romero, maybe I'll just push him. Let's kill the armor. Oh shit. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh lords. Oh, that crosshair is gonna be a bitch. Uh, yeah, that was a really, really random headshot. Okay. Mm, it didn't pick up the clue. And yeah, I was saying that I can definitely tell that uh, the... Mm, FPS, like, is, went down. Because I also heard that uh, the shots are here. That they, like, increase the, the specs requirements. We have a Moz in the sort of Romero. This is a really, really nice start. Mm. Yeah, but the game looks really nice. But I guess that some players were, are gonna have some problems with the performance, so I definitely had to like decrease my settings to be able to play it nicely. Holy shit, that quick scope to the head was insane. I just started saying that I'm gonna be a little bit afraid about, like, you know, the crosshair calibration, because for 2000 hours I was, like, uh, adjusted to play with the lowered crosshair, but yeah, the that first head was sweet. So these dudes are somewhere over. There was a horse from. Monsha Smolt. I think that's the. I don't think that's the proper way to, to call that compound. Let's see. There is one clue. Okay, let's attack. Let's be brave. I'm not gonna snipe from that distance. Let's just let's just go for the open fight. Oh. Okay. Okay, so Hellhounds might eat him a little bit. He went. There is the toy. Oh, he there is. Okay, he could run behind the fence. I see. Oh shit. Yeah, let's reload and push. It hunt. It's quite hard to uh, land a headshot if the guy is moving. And right now also there is this bullet drop. So we need to keep that in mind. Oh shit. Oh, this is someone else. And this is another hunter, guys. Uh, the other dude is gonna push, so let's go here. So we'll have uh, the guy we just hit a moment ago stuck between us. That was a headshot. And there will be another guy from behind. Someone here. 
Yeah, yeah he's there. Well, from this angle, maybe it should work. There's another person coming here. Okay, I was leading too much, definitely. Oh, wow, we got shot with the dual with the pistols to the head from 35 meters. Okay, but was, uh, that was a nice try for the first game. Let's go for the next one. All right, guys, let's go for the game number two. Uh, there is a huge like increase in the like the water details because basically right now the water just looks like a Like a mirror, so that's uh, That's nice We spawned with the dual wielded pistols, which is this well not the same But uh, we also died from dual wielding in the previous game Hmm, I wanted to go for the graystone pit, but I think that I will go for the mine Oh, uh, there's a shitty traversal no, let's go, let's go here, let's go here. As for the second game, I can tell that people are like... At the beginning playing louder than on the... Quick play usually, but that's understandable because like... You know, trying out the weapons and stuff. We have the dogs, do you want to scare them? Probably not. Oh wow, these dogs aggroed from quite far away. Alright. Yeah, this map definitely brings like a completely new vibe, you know? Oh shit. There is a player somewhere nearby. Question is where? Oh yeah. Adios. Oh, the carbine is so good. What did he have? Uh, also had the dual wielded pistols, right? I think this is a Scottfield, but. Oh, wow, that dropped in a quite funny, quite funny way. I think he was holding dual wielding. Maybe I'm wrong. All right. And this didn't have to be the actual player that uh, triggered the clue at the first, at the first occasion. So let's be careful. Hmm. Okay, let's go because these two compounds supposedly have some like um, new way of changing the dynamics in the game because they're like located underground. I think yeah, this is this huge mountain in the middle of the map. Am I thinking right? Yeah, so this is the center of the map now guys, which I have to tell you is quite interesting. The only problem I see with it is that they made, um, like, the center of the map basically a confined space, so people are gonna be even more tempted to play shotguns. Which me, personally, I'm not a huge fan of. Okay, I have no idea how should, how should I move around. Okay, the clue is clear. Okay, there is a hunting bow. And I think there should be another clue available, right? Somewhere close. Maybe not. This one is... Okay, yeah, these are different compounds already. Okay, so let's explore the mine. Oh, there is even a different sound. Like uh, echoing a little bit. That's a nice detail. Where do we go? I think we go to that La Plata mine. Mm. Concertina strip mines. Uh, let's take them. Oh, 
Alright, so let's head west. Oh yeah, we need to watch out for that freaking Hellborn. I guess... Oh, this is the new sound trap, the bats. Mm. Okay, let's see what happens if we'll just pass. I see. Okay, so this is pretty loud. Because they just uh, fly out and start screaming. They're still screw. Or oh, that was a hype, I'm not sure. But yeah, that they give away quite much info. Parkouring at the Bayou 2.0. I don't know the map at all. Okay. Ay, shit. Lost health a little bit. Is this the Crown and King? Yeah, it is. Okay, so f it's called Out of Five right now. What is the Conversion Pistol? And honestly, I think I'll take it. Uh, yeah, and we'll take the Crown and King. We're going for the uh, for attacking the Wellspring. Okay, from now on it would be nice to keep quiet. Oh shit! Okay, lost a lot of health. And I'm not sure if uh, I scared these birds. Sorry, the, the dogs barking behind me. Mm, I'm gonna heal with my own, not gonna risk it from now. Alright, let's go. Okay, full ammo. We don't have any consumables beside the uh, wax dynamite. So that might be a little bit problematic. Definitely some healing would be nice. Oh shit. Where from? Chogums, no. Oh shit. Uh, is there some healing inside? Sadly, no. Knuckle knife. Maybe, yeah, maybe let's take it for the emulators. I need to heal with mine. Oh nice, that was not a headshot and just kill him with two taps. Okay. Let's be vigilant for another player. I'm not sure if they changed the damage of the guns. Jesus, they changed the... basically all the names. Infantry fields, it looks like a regular Winfield, I think. Yeah, it is, okay. And what else did this guy have? I think nothing. It would be also... Oh, there was the pistol Nagant. Okay, but this is the regular, not officer, so this is too slow. I'm gonna stay with the with the conversion. What would be nice would be like, instead of just picking up the guns from the ground, uh, would be to use this solution that's, uh, that's like many other games. That you just open like a menu and you're just dragging guns, you know? They're not just lying randomly around in the grass, bugging disappearing and stuff we have the resupply so maybe there are gonna be some some way to upgrade the p oh there's a bomb lance oh shit no i'm gonna take the crown king for sure okay let's go around we're gonna pass through that bridge right here Shit, don't scare the horse. Oh, there was a guy. 
He just passed inside to the right. Okay, he's going up here. Ooh, that was so close. Oh shit. Oh no. There is some someone else here. I think I'll just wait a little bit for my health to to go back to normal. Okay, there's lots of time unless the uh, the bounty holder is gonna start killing everyone. Uh huh. What was that? Also, some different type of a scary shotgun. Okay. So, someone died behind. Okay, I don't know how to proceed. Okay, maybe here. Oh shit, Dolch. Dolch Crown and King, we cannot lose it now. I think we win on time, by the way. There is someone sneaking behind. Was it? Nice. Okay. Yo guys, this is Iron from the future speaking. Guys, I didn't realize, but the biggest change about quick play right now so far, I think, is that the fact that uh, in the past, Mm, only if the wellspring holder uh, killed another player, the wellspring was like decreasing. Uh, but right now, uh, you can see that there was like uh, 70 something points, I think, still to go. Uh, and when I killed that player, mm, it instantly went down to, uh, to basically like 5 or 4. So I think this is the biggest change, because uh, right now, it's uh, when there's a fight ongoing for the bounty, for the, for the wellspring, and there's uh, not ma not a lot of time. It's not like the RNG that if the if the guy that's attacking is gonna win, uh, you will still have some time. Because regardless of uh, which player is gonna kill whom, uh, the timer decreases anyway. So uh, yeah, I didn't realize that uh, in the game. Uh, but I think this is uh, really worth to mention, cause uh, yeah, as I said, I missed it. Uh, so far, definitely the biggest change for the quick play mode. So second game and we won. Um, well, yeah, the gameplay is pleasant. It's nice that they made the uh, the crosshair uh, to the center on the screen, cause well, maybe not many people were waiting for it, but uh, definitely some. I was one of them. And uh, yeah, the map is beautiful. Uh, the design of the compounds is also really interesting. And um, like the fact that we have a mountain on the on the middle of the map and only uh, they can be accessed only like with the uh, closed space is an interesting, but at the same time, a little bit afraid of the shotguns shifting even a bit harder towards meta. So yeah. Mm, but this, these are my first impression guys, thank you so much for watching, uh, please subscribe to the channel if you didn't do it yet, uh, for more content from Hunt mostly, and yeah, if you are wondering why I'm not uh, wearing that Adidas shirt, it's because it's hot today, bye bye.